Pam, and I'm one of the intercessors with Abba Worldwide Ministry. This past week, you may have noticed that I've been doing a lot of postings, asking for prayer requests, because we have a group of intercessors from 10 o'clock to 11 o'clock, praying and interceding Monday through uh, Friday. There were two uh, prayer requests that, that came in this week that really touched my heart. One individual had messaged that she was very suicidal and wanted to end her life. We had another individual that also messaged that she was um, depressed and didn't know what to do. I'm sure that there are many of you out there also that are feeling these same feelings, especially now that the coronavirus has us limited to how much interaction we have and not being able to go out. So I want to tell you that there is hope for your situation. I want to tell you that there is hope to be free from that sadness and that depression. You may be saying to yourself, well, that's easy for you to say. You don't know what I'm going through. I may not know exactly what you're going through, but I want you to know that I've been in your shoes. You see, when I was um, in my late teens, I tried to commit suicide. I didn't have any purpose in my life. So I took an overdose of Valium, had to be hospitalized, and they had to pump my stomach. I had such a void in my life and nothing seemed to fill that void. Well, a co-worker introduced me to one of her best friends, and her best friend's name was Jesus Christ. When I accepted Jesus Christ into my life, my life totally changed. That void that I felt in my life for so long, it was finally filled. I finally felt like I had a purpose in my life, and now I really enjoy serving the Lord. I may not be happy all the time, but I want you to know that I have found joy. And that joy is what gives me the strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength. I want to read a promise uh, to you today. And it's found in Isaiah chapter 43, and it's verse 2. And it says, When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And through the rivers, they shall not overflow you. When you walk through the fire, they shall not be burned, nor shall that flame scorch you. What does this promise mean? That means that if you're going through deep waters, you're not going to drown. If you feel like that test that you're going through, that that fire is going to burn you, that's not so, because God is going to be with you. No matter how difficult things may seem, I want you to know that God can see you through those situations. So I want to pray for, for those that are watching this video, that are, are struggling, going through sadness, depression, uh, having suicidal thoughts. I want to pray with you. First, I want you to know that God loves you very much. He loves you so much that He gave His Son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross, not only for your sins, but to free you from that sadness and that depression. So I want you to know that in your situation, it's only temporal. But if you put your faith in Jesus Christ, that faith is eternal. So if you would just put your trust in Him, He's going to give you the strength to overcome what you're going through at this time. So would you pray with me? Dear Lord Jesus, I need you. I'm in a desperate situation, and I need to put my trust in you. So I ask, Lord, for forgiveness of my sins. I ask, Lord, that you take control of my life. I choose to put you first, Lord, and I put my trust in you. In Jesus' name. That's how simple it is to come to salvation. Now, now that you've made that decision, I want to pray for you. And I want to rebuke any anxiety, any sadness, any depression that may be over your life. So pray in agreement with me. Father, in the name of Jesus, I take the authority that you have given me. And through the precious name of Jesus, I bind every spirit of sadness. 
I bind every spirit of, of depression. I bind the spirit of suicide in the name of Jesus. I order it off of the lives of those that are watching this video right now. I order sadness to go in Jesus' name. I order depression go in Jesus' name. I order every suicidal thought to go lose your subconscious mind right now in Jesus' name. I order those demons to be loosed out of you right now in Jesus' name. I speak shalom over your life. I speak the peace of God over your life. I declare the promise of Isaiah 43 over your life. Father, I ask, Lord God, that you fill them with your joy. Fill them with the joy of your Holy Spirit, Lord. Father, I ask, Lord God, that you fill their, their, their home, Lord, with your shalom. Father, I ask it in the precious name of Jesus. I want to encourage you, if you are struggling with sadness, depression, if you need extra prayer, please message me. I will call you. If you have other prayer requests, please send those messages in. We have a group of intercessors that are waiting to pray and want to lift up your needs. We take every prayer request to the throne of God, presenting your petitions before God. I bless you. Please send in those requests and be blessed in the name of Yeshua. Amen.